This is the coach of the Dallas Mel Metals. Um, pretty scary team, actually. Uh, yeah, that's right. Pretty scary team, actually. They had this Necrozma. Um, I just played a game against the Necrozma, and it was suboptimal. Um, <laughs> and he also has a rain mode to keep it even safer, because my biggest threat to it is actually Heatram. So that could be really annoying to deal with. Let's see what he brought. Okay, no rain mode. Is that good or bad? That's bad, right? Okay, so we are going to do... So we have the Tapu Koko with the Nature's Madness to try and get rid of this, like, frustratingly bulky Necrozma. Um, what else do I like here? Oh, so I was advised to bring Haps on. I didn't bring it. That's, that's really annoying me, but never mind. Cresselia. Uh, I think we get Lapras over Cresselia. Especially game one. I'm trying to see what he brings. The Uxie might be a little bit hard to break. Um, not really looking forward to that, but... I think there's bigger things to worry about there. It's a really strange team. I didn't expect that. He had this quite sort of strong ring core. I need to be careful with this. Oh, what is it? Shed Ninja. Because the only thing I have to hit it with is my Heatran. So that kind of has to come every game now. I wonder if you spot that. Oof. Alright, let's get into it. Cross and off the map. Yeah. Okay. So the first I need to know is the is the ability to do fifty percent to him. Has to be Magma Storm. Yeah, it has to be Magma Storm. Hopefully no protector, but I need to get this thing just just gone. Oh, okay, okay, you might have read that. Um, I wonder what he goes for. Okay, so protect on the Cosmo. Sludge bomb. Um, that might kill me. Yeah. Okay. So our next best answer to that. I don't want to send you out just now. So am I still scarfed if I didn't get the move out? I think I am, right? Let's protect. I'm going to get Magma Storm anyway, because I think the chip might... Okay. What comes in to take this? Oxy. Okay, so we need to get the damage over time on this thing. Oh, okay. This is a really rough start for us. Um, he doesn't really have the best fire switch in over an Interrotonator, which I don't think he has because he would have went for it right then. Uh, he's looking at a Volt switch. Oh, I wish... I did have a power on, a bit annoying. He's probably still going to do that, right? What do you vote switch into? Probably in the crossbar. Honestly, this might just be a Parish Song. Let's start putting pressure on things. Um, am I still choice? Yeah. Okay. Let's get Magma Storm into this slot, actually. No, it's not. Um, because he probably won't do that again. Let's find out. Okay, so we, we hit the Magma Storm this time. Does decent damage and traps it. Okay, so the Volt Switch comes out. There's a fair chunk. Poor 
probably knows I'm Scarf now. Um, yeah, he knows I'm Scarf now. So the thing is, this, this is unless he's also Scarf, which we know he's not. What is it see for? Oh, trick room. Okay. See, if he has a ground move or, you know, even a fighting move. Let's think about this in a minute. It could be worth saving Heatran because of the scarf. I can now protect again. I mean, you're slower than the Cosmo, right? And he ain't the first still move at me. Yeah. Mm, I don't like this. It depends what he's going to throw here. If I can save Heatran, then the Scarf might come in and clutch at the end. I'm going to put pressure on him now with a pair of Song anyway. What does he get it for? Maybe a ground move? Encore. Okay. So he's on guys. Okay, so that's not too bad for me. Never used Parasong before. This is exciting if I can get this off. So he's going to want to encore this lap person to protect, probably. How many times a trip room left? So free on the Um, Let's think about this a minute. I reckon he wants to switch into Cosma out. Do I let Lapras go down? Or do I bring Heatran in and hopefully catch the Encore? Okay, does Heatran still out some turns here? Hopefully he went for Calyrex here. Okay, so he's got the foul play. I think I'm especially defensive, not physically. Um, we'll find out now. Oh, oh, that's good. Okay, so this is interesting. Because he has to switch that now. And we know it's fun to rush, yeah? Looks he's dying anyway. But do we know it's fun to rush? I mean, it could be anything, but... Either way, you're safe to protect. I mean, you could fire a still move. I could do a free switch here. But no, he's going to switch to Thunder Us. Let's hit the Glacial Lands off and try and kill it on the way in. Yeah. Could we turn it here? Could be annoying? Yeah. It's a little bit annoying. It's not the worst. I don't think this would kill me. No. So Oxy's dead here anyway, right? We get the weakness policy proc. Um, it just might not. I mean, it matter now into this Turtonator, but it won't matter against the Cosma. Unless Trick Room's still up. I can't remember how many turns are left. Huge damage in the turret. That's good. The crit, uh, somewhat mad, but I think it died to Perish Strong anyway, so. I'll get the inevitable. Oof. Mm. You're also weakness policy? Oh no, lefties. So Calyrex now has a huge target on his back, surely, right? Please say Trick Room's still up. So down goes Labras. Should have thought of that, should have switched out, shouldn't I? Never mind. So now we're in an interesting position, because whether Trick Room goes up or not, we kind of have a good, a good play here. Um, Trick Room's still up your last turn. Yeah, one more turn. Heatran has absolutely nothing. Um, we'll get Magma Storm here. 
praying. I think they should kill. We're at plus two. He'll probably protect it. Yeah, I should have went to What an idiot. Yeah. Oh, what an idiot. Okay. Okay, we need to learn. Doesn't kill. Interesting. But overheat doesn't kill him either. Which is a little annoying. Oh, I can't use overheat now anyway. So I think we're... Yeah, we're going to lose this game. Um... Reflect. No, I think it's here. Yeah, we're going to lose this game. We have good info for next time around. Though. I don't think Tapu Koko was any good here. Like, at all. Like, at all, at all. Alright, what is the... What is the accuracy on this move? Because why is it missing so much? Let's have a look. First, that's the sort of thing I probably should know before going into this. Uh, oh, yeah, 75. Okay. Glacier Lance is tempting. Yeah, we're kind of a... Okay. Can we really do it hitting this? No. I don't think I'll be carrying this move again. Um, so what do we... What could we have really done with that other than Tapu Koko? Maybe the fake out. The fake out would have been a bad option. What else did I bring? I mean, Lapras nearly worked very well. Vesalia. Yeah. Uh, he knows I'm going to target this across with high horsepower, right? He might protect it. Yeah, it doesn't matter. You should finish it here now with the still move yet. Right, okay. So we lose game one. What can we do differently? Um, what can we do differently? Heat trans still not bad, I just think using a more reliable I think using overheat would be a lot better. Um Yeah, I just don't think Tapu Koko was doing anything for me there. I mean he might bring a different team, so that's kind of a big assumption. Um can I give the same four? Hitman top, not much more helpful if I'm being honest. What I put on Chris Elliott was like helping hand and ice beam. Yeah, it's not much more helpful. He might bring the zap this time. What did he have the ground move on? Terminator one, yeah. It seems crazy, but I think I can go the same four. And just play it better. Like fake house nice. That's about it. Think, 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 think.
Yeah, we're just gonna play it better. Or, or you know, we'd have to take a loss. Damn it, these cross ones are hard to deal with. So he's probably gonna expect if he sees the same lead, he'll expect it to do the same thing again. Hmm. Okay. I suppose Willie is the question. He sees us out there, he probably switches out the Thunderous, right? That would be a big assumption for me to make. He probably thunders in U turns, if I had to guess. Um, protects in U turns. Ah, oh, it's really annoying because I don't care too much about that. Rule Thunder, it's probably not the best thing to do. Let's protect myself in case he tries to U-turn off of me. I'm tempted to do this, but I think... Will he protect it again, turn one? Yeah, I think he will. I think he will, making a read. Or making a very bad read. Come on, let's see the protect. Oh, he didn't protect, man. Alright, we get good damage into that. Oh, dear, dear, dear. Where's my Calx? I'm minus two right now. Yeah, overheat just doesn't do it anymore. That's GG's, man. I think I have to let Heatran go down here. Let's just get damage on it. Oh, damn it. That's really disappointing. I just, I, I can't deal with these things. I don't know what it is. Yeah. We have got to fucking pray now to get through this. That is not possible. It's not possible to get through this. Even Perish Song just is not possible. We've just got to start throwing moves. We need to get the zap. What does he do here? Oof. Wish I had the help in hand now. That might have made the difference. I doubt it, but. He went first. Kali went first. They probably killed Lapras. Reflect? No. no I don't think so. Yeah, it, just, it just doesn't matter, does it? Because even if I get a Perish Song, we just kill me and Calyrex before kills them. Yeah, GG's. GG's to death is. I knew it was going to be rough. I just knew I wasn't going to break this thing. It's two in a row. Two in a cross was in a row I had to play.
And trust me, this went better than the other one. I don't think a crit would even kill that thing. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Yeah, GG to their players. That was a really just well prepared team. Um, I will eventually learn how to deal with these Necrozmas. And that is my next one to learn. Good luck in your future ones, man.